book on the jury yet. Four. The 16th race of the two March Country Chiefs race number four. This marks the middle of the Chiefs and the beginning of the round of eight. If a if one of these eight ch one of if an, one of the eight chasers win, then they will get then they will get um themselves a, a spot in the final four. Brad Keselowski starts on the pole. Won the race here earlier this year. And he's sweet. Kansas just dominated the race er earlier this season, but didn't find victory lane. Can he do that today? Hendricks Jr. seems to struggle with qualifying here. Qualified 10th today. Qualified 16th um, earlier this season and ended up finishing 2nd. Can he climb up from 10th to 1st? Drivers, start your engine! Now here's the second for today's race in row one. We have Brad Keselowski and Ryan Blaney. In row two, we have Jamie McMurray and Joey Logano. In row three, we have Matt Kenseth and Kevin Harvick. In row four, we have Kyle Larson and Darrell Wallace Jr. making his final start in season one, most likely. Down in row five, we have Carl Edwards and Martin Trek Jr. In row six, we have a pair of chasers, Kyle Busch and the fan favorite, Dale Earnhardt Jr. In row seven, we have... Jimmy Johnson and Eric Almarola. In row eight, we have a chaser, Denny Hamlin, and a non chaser, Ryan Newman. In row nine, we have teammates, Chase Elliott and Casey Kane. Chase Elliott's still a chaser, and Casey Kane got eliminated in the last round. Ryan Altafield today. In row ten, we have a chaser, Kurt Bush, the lowest starting chaser, and Austin Dillon. Here's a race for today's race. Stage points will be awarded on laps 4 and 8 of 15. Brad Keselowski is on the pole. And this is the first race of the round of the The green flag is out as Brad Keselowski leads him down. Ryan Blaney in second. Joey Logano third. As here comes Blaney on the inside. As they head into the tight turn 2, Keselowski gets a great run. But Ryan Blaney is faster in turn 4 and around goes the 488. The 17 of Darrell Wallace Jr. involved as well. The caution is out here on the second lap of today's race. Let's see who was involved. It was Jimmy Johnson. He got eliminated in the last round. Not so super Superman. And then also Darrell Wallace Jr. He, those two drivers will both be done for the day. Looks like Johnson just got loosened. Darrell Wallace Jr. said nowhere to go. We can't the replay. And here's the stage one. Ryan Lee first. Brad Keselowski second. Kyle Larson third. And Matt Kenseth fourth. Um, the only chaser who scored points for stage one. And Joey Logano. Under the yellow, Donna Jr. and Carl Edwards stayed out. And Kyle Larson took two tires. He's in the third position now. Ryan Lee is the first car with four tires. And he starts fourth. Kevin Harvick also took two tires. He's in seventh. Kurt Busch was too fast entering. Chase Elliott had man over the wall too soon. No restart on lap 5 of 15. The green flag is out. Kyle Larson makes it three wide for the lead. Kyle Larson to the lead. Donut Jr. behind the battle with those old tires, but he can't. He here comes Matt Kenseth to take the second spot away from Brad Keselowski. As he's trying to get around the 42. It's hard to pass here. And now he gets underneath him and clears him around. Goes to 42. The caution is out here on lap number 7 for Kyle Larson. He got eliminated in the last round. And let's take a look at the replay. It looks like he died. It was clear, but wasn't he clipped the grass. And he's a stage 2 results. Matt Kenseth wins the stage. That is going to be very important for him. Brad Kozlowski second. Jamie McMurray third. Ryan Lee fourth. And Denny Hamlin in fifth. Two chasers getting stage points. Both Gibbs cars. Kurt Busch, Eric Omerola, Austin Dillon, and Casey Kane all stayed out under the yellow flag. 
And Carl Edwards Martin Truex Jr. were too fast exiting. Donut Jr. was too fast entering. So pet roll penalties being big today. Right, and we're getting ready to restart. Two on lap number ten of fifteen. The green flag is out. Skirpus leads him down. And Austin Dillon in the three car trying to take the second trying to hold on second, but now Mac Hendrick trying to take the lead away with the fresh tires. And Skirt Bush actually is doing really well as Mac Kendrick just can't get around him. It's very out of hazard and around goes a twenty four Chase Elliott. And he gets into the nineteen of Carl Edwards and Kyle Bush. See who is involved and they will be out of the race. We have Chase Elliott, the twenty fourth Chase Elliott, the nineteen car of Carl Edwards and the eighteen of Kyle Bush. All of them were involved. Lenny Logano and Martin Truck Jr. all stayed out under the yellow. So um, see how that pitch a little bit of pitch worked out worked out for them. And Austin Dillon was too fast entering, so he'll have to go to restart in the back of the back. So we are going to restart with just two laps to go. The green flag is in the air. Kurt Busch makes a three wide. And right now, Ryan Lane leads. Kurt Busch trying to take the second spot away. Can Blaney hold him up for another whole lap? I don't think, I just don't think he can do it. And here he comes, down on the inside. Matt Kenton to make it three wide for the lead. And uh, to the finish, checkers, I don't know who's win who won. Let's see who won. It looks like Kurt Busch wins, and he will lock himself into the championship four as he celebrates with a really cool burnout. Now let's look at our race results. Says congratulations to Microsoft Cup on their victory. As Matt Kenton, Ryan Blaney, Denny Allen, and then repulsed her. Um, Brad Keselowski even is seventh, and so yeah. Now, sorry about this. I forgot to change the points thing, so the points are good and points are bad, are incorrect. But the where everyone is, um, that is correct. And all the good points standing. It looks like the battle for thirteenth is really close. Next race is going to be at Kansas. Speedway.